Dr. Shetty to edit us speak. A little different question today. Can a doctor discuss with a patient's relative the investigation reports of the patient or the line of treatment of the patient in the absence of the patient? The relationship between a doctor and a patient is a relationship of a trust. Mm. And specific patient specific information has to be avoided in the mm. absence of the patient or without the express consent of the patient. Mm. So what if the patient is a minor or a mentally unstable patient? As far as minor patients or incompetent patients or mentally unstable patient goes, hmm. it can be discussed. Patient specific information can be discussed with the legal guardian of the patient. So this may be true in the western countries where the treatment is more individual oriented. But in countries like India, major healthcare decisions are taken by the family or for that matter extended families. Then what should be done? Here the conditions in India very, may be different compared to western countries. Here the doctor may have to take a judgment call. Hmm. If it is a mother, if it is a wife, then the doctor may have to take a call whether to discuss patient patient with a relative. Here too, hmm. the confidentiality has to be maintained. Sir, what if the patient's relative turns up with an investigation report and wants the doctor to interpret it? If the patient's relative turns up with the investigation reports and wants an interpretation of the report, in the absence of the patient or an express consent of the patient, then a doctor has to avoid discussing it without the patient's consent. In a recent judgment from the State Consumer Commission, the mother of the patient turned up out of town without an appointment to meet the doctor to discuss how the patient was examined by the doctor previously. The mother wanted the doctor to interpret the investigation performed. The doctor refused to do so because the patient was absent and there was no consent from the patient. The mother filed a case of negligence against the doctor stating this was deficiency of service. The court could not find fault with the protocol followed by the doctor. The court accepted the fact that the doctor was right in refusing to discuss patient information without the presence of the patient or the express consent of the patient. Sir, so then what would be your take-home message in such situations? See, the only institution which can make a doctor change his uh, refusal is a written order from a court of law. Hmm. Else, any illegal request, any unusual request by a patient's relative without the expressed consent or in the absence of the patient hmm. should be rejected outright. Thank you, Dr. Shetty, for your valuable inputs. Thank you.